So I'm just starting a new piece now. I'm going to do the female version of Leap of Faith. And what I'm doing is I'm creating the pose, um, working on that, trying to capture the right look and feel, first of all, before I start sculpting. I've taken the body of um, Born Within Fire, female piece, and now I'm putting it up against the male version of Leap of Faith. I may change the angle slightly, but I like the male version in the background where the head is up and it creates a bit more of a dynamic feel. It's more of an abandonment as you jump. I love my morning walks. Me and Mr. Jaeger walking through the forest. Look at the sun, that winter sun when it's really low down. I absolutely love that, coming through the trees. Really excited about getting back into the studio again. <sighs> nice morning, nice and fresh. Life's good. I've just taken the head off of the sculpture so I can work in it in more detail to refine the finer details of the piece. I like to do this. One, it's in your hands, it's more comfortable, you can turn it and you can see where you are. But I generally do this with each fine component like the hands, the feet, the head, I remove them so I can work on them. I'm up in London for the weekend. Come up to meet Nasheed from De Joya for my jewellery. Um, the jewellery designs which I've done at the beginning of last year now. Um, yeah, really cool. Looking forward to it. Looking forward to a London weekend as well. We're meeting up in uh, Notting Hill. Yeah. And then uh, after that, gonna go out and have a bit of fun in town. <laughs> also look at this, look how cool this is. See all the wildlife sculptures? I've popped into the foundry to see my work, to pick up my molds. Always find it interesting whenever I come to the foundry, see what work's going through, see what the guys are up to. This is my piece, um, Born Within Fire, in the shelling up room. I'm working here on the hand. I've taken the arm off, just so I can work the fine details of the hand. One, I can move the hand to fit the shape of where the model's hand is. And it allows me then to do this fine sculpting, and I'm really doing a lot of removing here sculpting into the wax. And I've done the same thing here with the foot. As you can see I took the leg off the knee and then um, modeled the whole of the foot. Just got the general proportions there. 